How to Be a Bad Bitch by Amber Rose. Page 228. Sexy Selfies. Never ever send nude photos to a guy. Hmm. When I say never, I mean fucking never. Amber, you. <laughs> if you do and then you break up, you'll have anxiety for the rest of your life whether he's going to put that shit out on social media. It's one thing to post seductively, partially naked photos online with full cover-ups, but what you're doing in bringing awareness that the whole world, world, I'm sorry, is potentially going to see them. Very true. But when a guy texts you and asks you for a nude picture, just think of the kids, your parents, your family, and everyone who could possibly see it on the internet and decides to leak it. It's not worth it. You might think it's okay to send a nude shot, but it doesn't include your face. But you could still identify your tattoos and other characteristics. If you absolutely have to send something, then make a sexy, sexy shot in your face and no cleavage. That's plenty. No nudes, no body shots. Trust me. I learned the hard way. If he wants to see you naked that badly, he can make the effort to come see you in the flesh. What do you think about what, he, what you just read? Do you agree with Amber or you disagree? I 100% agree. <laughs> now, let me tell you why I agree. I agree. I mean, things are so different now. Um, when you send out nude shots, count yourself as everybody's unseen it at that point because I, I just have a thing with the, like, the whole iPhone thing. <laughs> like, why don't you take nude shots? Like, I don't know. The big companies and everything might be looking at you. But besides all of that, we live in a world now it's different and loyalty is hard to come by so if you break up with the ex you break up with your man you do things like that just be prepared for the outcome or if anything comes up out of that but your husband totally different of course that's my husband of course I'm gonna you know for the husband but for the guy and the dating and things like that you just have to take precaution and you have to make sense and you have to do it you know at the right time if you're gonna do it do it at, make sure you do it at the right time and you're okay with that be okay with your decisions that's what we got to do as women. So I agree. How to be a bad bitch. <laughs>